taking photos of your food. Why do you take photos? Of your, oh, look at me, I've got egg and chips. Look at that, that is a gorgeous looking egg and chips there, isn't it? I'm going to take a photo of that, stick it, send it to all my friends. <laughs> look at my egg and chips, look at me, living my best life. <laughs> Didn't take photos of the uh, food in the 70s, did we? No, because it was a logistical nightmare, wasn't it? Because you take the photo, and then you have to take another 23 photos to use up the roll. <laughs> hoping to God it wasn't a 36. And then you remove the film from the camera, put it in a bag, take it to Boots, wait for a week, and then go and pick it up and take it around your mates go, that's where for dinner last Tuesday. <laughs> and they would look at you and they'd go, why are you showing me a photo of egg and chips? And I would say, well, that it will be de rigueur in 40 years' time, that shit. <laughs> Loads of things we didn't have in the 90s. You know what else we didn't have in the 1970s, Marsha? You know what else we didn't have? Nut allergies. <laughs> Nut. Well, we might have done, but we didn't know, did we? Friends used to just randomly drop dead. <laughs> it was a very tense and upsetting time, wasn't it? You remember, you'd phone up your mate saying, you're coming round for the nut party. <laughs> oh, yeah, we still love a nut party. I said, what have you got? Oh, I've got macadamias. Well, I am there. Come round for the nut party, you'd be happily munching away, wouldn't you, on your nuts? You go, oh no! What's happened to Keith? <laughs> oh, fucking hell, that's a shame. I liked him, he was alright, wasn't he? Oh, well, I'll have his nuts if they're going. <laughs>